through range cervical spine strengthening exercises. If you need to improve the strength in your neck, then this is an excellent group of exercises. I would suggest that you begin with the isometric cervical strengthening exercises first and progress to this once you are able. These are advanced exercises and should be done with care and only if you are ready for them. Remember these exercises should be pain free during, after and the next day. Obviously it is normal to feel some delayed onset muscle soreness between 48 to 72 hours but this should be manageable. It is also important to perform all exercises in good posture at all times. Flexion. With good neck posture, lying on your back with your head hanging off the edge of a bed or bench. Hold a weight plate onto your forehead with a towel or cushion in between for comfort. Next, slightly tuck your chin in and slowly lower your head down towards the floor and slowly back up. Extension. With good neck posture, lying on your front with your head hanging off the edge of a bed or bench. Hold a weight plate onto the back of your head with a towel or cushion in between for comfort. Next, slightly tuck in your chin and slowly lower your head down towards the floor and slowly back up. Side flexion. With good neck posture, lying on your side on the floor, hold a weight plate onto the side of your head with a towel or cushion in between for comfort. Next, slightly tuck your chin in and slowly lower your head down towards the floor and slowly back up. Repeat for the other side. For strength, you need to perform six to 10 repetitions to failure and perform three to five sets. For endurance, you need to perform 15 to 25 reps to failure and perform three to five sets. Rest needs to be at least three minutes between sets for strength and no more than 30 seconds if you are doing the exercises for endurance. You should aim to perform the session two to three times per week.